Welcome friends, Kevin here with Camper Clothes and Chaos, and we are a full-time reselling couple. We travel up and down the East Coast, picking up goods and reselling anything we can to make a buck. Right now, we are back in North Carolina. This has been our honey hole for donations. Since we can't go to our thrift stores and pick up what we normally do, we've been down here on the Nextdoor app and Facebook Marketplace, collecting free donations and sorting through them. By the end of the day, this truck, this trailer, will be full of goods that we'll be listing for sale. Come along for our journey today. Okay, so we just got back from our first pickup. It was a huge success. Filled the truck up, not a whole lot of clothes, if any, mostly hard goods and kids' toys. But we're gonna go through it here and we'll set the good stuff aside, kind of talk about that. Everything else is gonna get loaded right into the trailer and head back to Ohio with us. So let's get started. Okay, so we just cleared out the back of the truck from that donation pickup. Here's a quick uh, how we got everything sorted. Uh, two and a half things of thread up. Uh, this whole box was basically thread up, so we're just gonna leave it in there and print off one of the thread up email uh, postage. We got two of our thread up bags. This one we can stick a little bit more in. Right here, uh, we've got a lot of kids stuff that we will put in lots and sell on eBay. There's quite a few books in here as well. Uh, as you know, we love ziffit.com for all of our books. So we will scan all of these in and see if they take them. If not, we've got a few different neighborhoods that have the little like birdhouse uh, things on corners that you could give a book, take a book. We like donating to those. Uh, we definitely encourage reading for kids. Um, and then we got kind of a few other bigger items that'll go on marketplace with the scooters and stuff. Uh, this is our trash bin. And then in here, we have got things that we're going to take back to Ohio with us. Uh, mostly good quality clothes and the rims that we found as well. So we've got a few more pickups to do and we'll keep you posted on what else we find. All right, welcome back. Day two. Day one ended up kind of being a bust. We just did the one pickup. We did get all this. There's nothing real spectacular. Three bags from Thread Up ready to go. And we ended up doing some uh, practice biking without training wheels. So it ended up being kind of a family day. But we're back on the hunt today and we'll keep you posted. Probably all gonna be good. 
Snowboard goggles. Talbots, both of them are Talbots. Um, another coat, Talbots. Uh, blowfish, Nautica, slip on, bamboo flip flops. Summertime, everybody's buying new flip flops. few finds here uh, I know they're beanie babies people hate on them but they are a set from ice age so those will sell uh, nautica slip-ons uh, size six smaller size than it's not real popular size but they will sell uh, vintage Winnie the Pooh that's a good seller uh, Darth Vader We've been having good luck with stuffed animals, plush animals lately, uh, so that should sell as well. It's about two foot tall. Uh, again, we got the snowboard gear, um, clothes-wise. Uh, let's see what we got. Gap, uh, not super impressed with the Gap jeans, but they will sell their men's 32-32. Uh, territory ahead, hiking gear. Hiking, uh, it's like a corduroy type material. Um, cut the tag size out, so we'll have to put our measurements. Uh, I'm gonna go with probably about an extra large, maybe a large. Reseller gold. Reseller gold right here. Melissa and Doug, kids with toys. Got a small tote of them. Tape gun, gotta love the tape guns. Always a good find. Uh, vintage Tommy sweatshirt. Uh, men size large. Um. Okay, and again, we got more books. Lots of books here, full tote. Um, again, you know we love Ziffit. Z-I-F-F-I-T dot com. And cookbooks are selling on eBay like crazy. So we will check comps on eBay of these first uh, and everything else gets scanned and we'll go from there and, and see what happens. Uh, if you follow us on Instagram, you saw yesterday, we had a bunch of kids books that were of no monetary value to us. So those went to our local park where they have a give a book, take a book, uh, just a small like walk up library type deal. Uh, that kids can come and grab a book, read it, and then return it. And we put about 10 different books in two different ones of those just to help the community out. So, but we're gonna see if there's any monetary value in these and the cookbooks will check comps on eBay and go from there. And we're gonna clear out the back of the truck and we got some more pickups this afternoon. All right, so we're back with the last of our pickups for the day. Nothing real spectacular. 
um, a few things that we'll put in our scrap pile to recycle, old coffee pot, some miscellaneous clothes, nothing that's great, that'll all probably go to thread up. And again, one of our favorite things that's easy at Good Money Maker, some books. We got another uh, whole box of books. So those we'll check on Ziffit if we can make a buck off them. If not, they get donated to our local bins. Uh, that's, so that's gonna be a wrap for the day. We appreciate you hanging out with us again. Find us on Instagram at Camper Clothes and Chaos. And you can find all of our clothes on Poshmark at thread underscore dealer, as well as the ship shop. Thanks, and join us on our next adventure.